going to take everything from you. Hello, everybody. Welcome to another edition of EPW. I'm Hollywood Jimmy, along with Joy Gross. And, man, this is going to be a great show right here. Hollywood, as you seen earlier, Marco Harris was attacked by Walker 13 as he arrived at the arena. He seems to be okay, and he's made a challenge right here today. You'll see it right here. That's going to be great. And also, Daniel Nova was put in a handicap match last week, and we're going to have it coming up right now with Cage Swiss and the front, front row hero. Is that great? You know, Justin Klein might be coming out here too. I can't stand. Come on, man. I can't Come stand on. This the front row hero no. is the best thing going right here at EPW. Well, you know what? Let's go ahead and get it started right now. Look at him rolling out the red carpet. Look, <laughs> finally. For who? Yeah, you know, you know who it is. The front row hero's coming out with Justin Klein. He's rolling out the red carpet. They deserve it. It's a joke. Commissioner Bates is out here making sure it gets done right, it looks like, directing traffic. Exactly right. I love it. I don't. Show respect. These people need to stand up. Look at this. They're about to come up. Come out. Look here. Come on, stand up, Joey. Show respect. Look at that trophy. Look at that Crossroads Cup. Look at that. The following contest is a handicap match set for one ball. Introducing first, accompanied by two fine Justin Klein, the team of the greatest of all time, K Swiss, and the winner of the 2024 Crossroads Cup, the Frat Row Hero, Brendan Savage. Oh my gosh, I love Brandon Savage. He's did the champion. What, he did you see what Justin Klein just done? Yes, I, he took pictures. He took he pictures. He jerked the, picture, the camera away from the camera lady to take a picture of the. I'm going to tell you, I think the commission needs to go back and look at the video on that Crossroads Cup match. And their opponents, accompanied by Bone Crusher from Boonville, Mississippi. Weighing 220 pounds, the sellout, Daniel Nova. What a cry, baby. I'm going to tell you something. I hope he gets his butt wheel whipped right here on EPW. He just, he just tore all the red, the red carpet or whatever they had down there for front row hero. He just tore all that He's up. just jealous. He's not jealous. Oh, yes, he is. Now, here's the commission. Now what? Now, what, what's going on here? It's going to be good news, I'm sure. What, what is he telling the referee? He's telling the referee something. What is? He's telling the announcer here. What? What's going on? What? Well, let's see what it is. I'm sure it's important. Ladies and gentlemen, I have just been informed. Per Commissioner Bates, Bone Crusher is banned from ringside. <laughs> No, oh, this is great. I love it. He told him he could be out here now. He's telling him he's got to be banned. He hasn't, got a manager. he hasn't got a manager's license. He hasn't got a manager's license. I mean, this guy can't even manage a car wash. Let alone try to manage a wrestler. I'm going to tell you what. This, this ain't right. This is the greatest thing ever. This is the greatest. I love it. Bye-bye, Bone Crusher. <laughs> Isn't this great? I love this. You see the front row hero didn't want no part of the sellout. He didn't want to start the match off. I love our new commissioner. Uh -oh. He makes he makes great decisions. Look at here. Yeah. Look. Out. Clean oh, look, break. A clean break by I can't believe it. So instead of three it's a three on one now. What are you three on one? How, what are you seeing? I don't know what you well, come on, give me a break. Actually with a commissioner, it's four on one. He could Pop out here well, it, if you remember correctly, last week he asked for this match. He did. Come on, Daniel Nova asked for this match. Yeah, I, I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? Oz is against him. K Swiss. The, oh, my word. He took K Swiss down. 
Referee, he's, get the he's calling for the referee. Pulling his hair. How you gonna pull somebody's hair with a shoulder block? He pulled his hair. I actually saw. I saw it. Come on, you man. Didn't Come on. I, did, that. I did see it. I did see. It. I, I watched it. He pulled his hair. I guess it's yeah. He's messing it up. Make it look like he oh the big boot. There Thanks. we go. It's about time. Oh yes. Choking him now. Look at there. Brandon Savage coming in here. Look at this. Hollywood, be sure to check out EPW Live. Go to EPWWrestlingMS.com for tickets and more information where we'll be next. What do you think about the Crossroads Cup champion in the ring? Is he showing out or what? If they go back and watch the film, they would probably realize that it should be to sell out Daniel Nova. But we'll oh, give me a break. What's wrong with you? Joey, you are the biased, the most biased announcer I've ever. Uh, I've, you, you are hard to work with. I'm you understand? Biased. That? You're a bias. You're so hard to work with. Oh no, this could. Be, he said no, but I'm gonna tell you, the sellout's in trouble, Hollywood. Yeah, oh. he is in trouble. But you know what? He deserves every bit of it. He's just like his daddy. He shouldn't be involved in wrestling. Now you know, you're the most biased too. What? I just tell the truth. What do you mean by bias? I'm sick of this. Come on. Oh, look at the double team here. Oh, oh yeah! Goodness. <laughs> I love this. One. And have you Whoa. noticed Justin Klein is smiling? He's got a smile on his face. He's happy. I can't blame him. He is right now. Everything, everything's going in his favor. Look at that! <laughs> I love it. Daniel Nova on the mat. He's been on the mat most of the match, by the way. Case Fuentes just hurt himself. It don't look like it. It does. <laughs> Well, a headbutt yeah. while ago. He was stunned and dazed there for a minute, but anyway, he's back on it. Look at that, going to that, going up there on that rope. Uh-oh. Second rope. Daniel Nova better get out of the way or this could be over. All right, the greatest of all time, Case Wiz comes oh. down and nobody's home. What a big mistake. Both men down, the ref right on it. Started the count right here. Klein looking a little nervous now, that little smirk on his face, trying to cheer on Case Wiz. Well, you, you, you've got a bad attitude, Joey. Well, Daniel Nova's in a handicap match. He ain't got nobody to tag to. Look at him. To I, I think he's trying to find somebody to tag. What a moron. Look at him. I don't think. I think he's trying to find a rope and get himself. Now, look at this. They, what are they, what? Where are they going? What? They left K-Swiss. They're leaving K- They're leaving K-Swiss? Yeah, he turned the tag down. Oh, oh, no, oh, what a clothesline. The winner of this match, the sellout, Daniel Nova! Wow, I can't believe what happened. They walked out on K-Swiss. I can't believe it. This guy, he's great. I can't stand it. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the true American, Trace Lee Hunt. So, 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 Trace, we have you out here at ringside, but your best friend's not with you. Where's, where's Danny Dollar? Listen, I'm going to stop you right there, Jonathan. Okay. First of all. Do me a favor, you do not know my friend, Danny Dollar. He is my friend, okay? So do me a favor and shut your mouth. Do me a favor and don't mention him, okay? And besides, we've got much bigger things to do. I am talking. Shut up, I am talking. We have much bigger things to deal with, starting with Mr. QT Marshall, okay? 
QT Marshall, I know you've worked for all these big companies. That's great. You're in the best shape of your life. That's fine. But let's not pretend, QT, like you haven't made a long list of mistakes in your career. Most recently, two mistakes that I'm going to point out for you. The first one is when you do... I am talking. Shut up. Shut your mouths. You ingrates. Shut up. First of all, you decided to take the patented move that my friend Danny Dollar created, the dollar cutter, and it's called the dollar cutter, not whatever the yoga guy calls it, okay? Second of all, you decided to mention me. You put my name in your mouth. So QT, out of all, I am talking! I am trying to speak, you morons. QT, out of all the list of mistakes that you've made, this one's actually going to help you out because you're going to be able to come here to the one person who can actually help you do better, get better, and be better. And that is the true American Trace Lee Hunt, the paramount of perfection, 230 pounds of American muscle, red, white, blue, tattooed, bald like an eagle, and QT Marshall. How do you like them apples? <laughs> I'll see you real soon, pal. I've used wood and fawn for years with my taxes, and I've been well pleased with every turnout that I've done with them, and I'm glad to know that she has my back. As long as she's been doing it, she's done it for me. I use wood and fun. My whole family uses wood and fun. I always get one-on-one -on -one service here. They treat me right and never have any problems. They enjoy being, coming here. At JMAX Steals and Deals, we're ready for spring, carrying your favorite home decor, gifts, and more. We're your floral headquarters and offer free delivery to all local funeral homes. Come by and see us at 2210 East Chambers Drive in Boonville. We can't wait to serve you. The following contest is set for one fall. Introducing first, from Memphis, Tennessee, weighing 197 pounds. The Last Dragon, Draco! This is the man everybody should watch. This man has got everything it takes to go to the top here in EPW. For once, I agree with you, Hollywood. Like it, love him or hate him, he does have what it has, what it takes to climb that ladder to success here for the chance, you know, chase the title. And his opponent, from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, weighing 210 pounds, DC, Daniel Cross. I got, a, I got a question. Is that is that Lance Russell's son? You ever notice that big nose he has on his face? What you? I'm just asking. Hey, I'm gonna tell you something. You talking about somebody with a potential? DC's got the potential too. Well, I have to admit, you know, no doubt about it, he's a veteran in this business, been around a long time. But you know what? Look at Draco, man. He's young. He's got what it takes. And I think he can take it to the top right here at EPW. Well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ask you this. I hope Trey Hunt didn't come out here. Come on. Last dragon, what happened? Challenge QT Marshall and insult him out here on live television, expecting him not to re respond in the ring. Yeah, that's going to be interesting, you know. I'm going to tell you something. You know what? Imagine right here. Yeah, QT Marshall, known all over the world, and he's right here in EPW. I can't wait for that. That's far from over, I promise you. But right now, Draco is taking it to DC. They both outside the ring. He just throws him back in. Uh oh. Oh, wow. Out there on the floor, man. He's giving the elbows right there. Look at that. Draco going to the top. Watch this. These two's got a little bit of a history too, Hollywood. They went one-on-one -on -one a couple of weeks ago, a couple of weeks back. 
You see that leg drop right there on the side of that apron? Right on his face? He's trying to catch his break, yeah, right on his chest. Look at that. DC's in trouble. Now a big stomp. The fans out here yelling for DC, chanting DC. I'm gonna tell you. Draco, he is the man, look at this. He's taking care of business right here at EPW. Oh! And he's bragging about it, you hear that? Did you hear what he said? He said he's gonna take him down. I hope they didn't just pop his arm out. That hurt, DC's in a lot of pain with that arm. He said no, he kicked out. Oh, Draco oh, all over the rail. He's upset with that referee. Can't you count? Come on. Come on. You know, they got their EPW school, but some of these referees can't count. What's up with that? Come on. You know, you know speaking of the EPW school, let EPW help you with your next big fundraising event. Visit EPWWrestlingMS.com for more details. And yeah, you can train to be a wrestler. You can train to be a manager. Matter of fact, if you train to be an announcer, you might be out. <laughs> Joe, you might be out of here. Oh, he is stomping that arm. Did he? DC's arm, he got a lot of damage. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him making fun He's of mocking DC. Him. He's mocking him. Look at him. Love Boy, it. Oh, DC kicks out. <laughs> I love this Draco. I love his attitude. This is great. You got to give it to DC. Showing a lot of heart here, man, with a hurt arm. Just... He's showing a lot of pain to me. Well, I mean, come on. <laughs> oh, oh, he missed. No. Oh, no. He got tied up in the ropes. Now his arm's tied oh, up. No, He's got to he... help him get out of it. Ah. He may have hurt his arm. Yeah, them, them, them ropes can hurt you. I'll tell you he what, is, he, he, he is hurt. They say he caught him. Oh, look at that jab. He's punching him in the face. Man, the he's right. Little old jabs. That ain't no fist, a jab. That is a fist. Big elbow. Oh, Big old elbow. Draco, you tell him, come on. He picks him up. Uh-oh. Oh, my goodness. It could be over with. Look at that, man. Man, right here. I thought DC had him. DC did too. What's bad about it? Ralph said too, though. Backs him in. Reversal. DC ducks under, catches him. He's, he's going out there for the ropes. He uses those ropes to, to his advantage every time. And look at that boot. Goes in the rope. Oh, and he missed with a big boot. Oh, and DC with it. I guess you call it a flying fist, but it knocked him. Oh, he got it. The winner of this match, DC Daniel Cross. He cheated his way. He cheated that win. He cheated. Look, he, he cheated. He didn't cheat. Yes, he he did. his way back up that ladder, right? A big win against Draco right here, DC. He cheated the entire match, he, and you know it. Come he on. He did not. Yes, he did. Throwing out fists, doing everything wrong. Always Nobody wanted to be in the professional wrestling business? The EPW Wrestling Academy is now enrolling. Visit EPWWrestlingMS.com for all the details on how to make your dreams a reality. Do you have what it takes? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the ringside area. Maddie, the American Patty. Now, Maddie, earlier today you requested this time. You said you had some things that uh, you wanted to air out for the EPW fans, and here we are. I actually have a lot to say. For one, I do not understand why all these fans would pick Diana over me. I mean, look at me, just saying. I look better, I wrestle better, and well really, that's all you really need to know right there. I mean, I think it's about time these fans have a woman that looks like a champion. This is my ring, this is my show, and I think it's about time that I get what I deserve. Top Bay out. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Maddie the American Batty will be back in moments. It was wood and bond for years with my taxes, and I've been well pleased with every turnout that I've done with them, and I'm glad to know that she has my back. 
as long as she's been doing it, she's done it for me. I use wood and fun. My whole family uses wood and fun. I always get one-on-one -on -one service here. They treat me right and never have any problems. They enjoy being, coming here. At JMAC Steals and Deals, we're ready for spring, carrying your favorite home decor, gifts, and more. We're your floral headquarters and offer free delivery to all local funeral homes. Come by and see us at 2210 East Chambers Drive in Boonville. We can't wait to serve you. The following contest is set for one fall and is for the EPW Heavyweight Championship. Introducing first the challenger from Memphis, Tennessee, weighing 290 pounds, the Memphis Made Monster, Walker Thirteen. You know, Marco Harris might be in trouble on this one. And his opponent, from Jackson, Tennessee, weighing 192 pounds. He is the EPW Heavyweight Champion, Mr. Energy, Marco Hangtime Harris. I don't think Marco's too happy. He got attacked earlier. You know. Yeah, he attacked him coming into the arena earlier. It's a, it's a wonder he's even here. Oh, look at this. Oh, he's upset. You can't blame him, though. Marco Hang Time Harris. A great EPW champion right here. But Walker 13 is going to be a big task. Look how big Walker 13 is. This guy's huge, way over like six foot five. Big guy. And he looks crazy. Look at those eyes. Doesn't look like nobody's home. I'm going to tell you, the champion's going to rely on the speed. The speed and agility with the quickness. He, oh, Ooh, he pushed him down. Look. There you go, the speed. Oh. What it's going to take. And Marco's definitely got the speed. And, and Walker 13 definitely got the, the power and the strength. Oh, oh, out of here. Knocks him out here on the concrete floor. Uh-oh. Watch. Is he fishing Hey, he's going to fly through the ropes. Oh, my goodness. He's all over Walker 13. It is fired up, and he's taking it to Walker 13. Well, you can't blame him. He's upset. So he caught him. Oh, he got, he's in trouble. But the champion fought out of it. Held on. Oh, wow. Did you see that? He'd like to knock him out. Did you hear how hard he hit the floor? He did. Look at this. He's, oh, look at He's on him. Oh, no. What is he going to do? You don't want to be outside the ring with Walker 13 because nope. there's too many. You better watch it. Watch it, Joey. Oh. Look at that. You got to give it to the champion. He's battling bad, but I'm going to tell you, Walker Hayes is in control right now. Man, you can hear those licks. Did you hear that? Walker 13 is pounding away on Marco Harris right now. He is. Oh, oh. my goodness. My word. Walker 13 might be our new champion. And he is a monster, I can tell you. Look how big this guy is, and he's just manhandling the champion. Oh, my goodness. The EPW champion, the first time I've ever seen, seen him right here, he's in trouble. He's in a lot of trouble. He better come up with something. I'm going to tell you, Walker 13 is, he may be climbing himself up to be the champion right here if Marco, if Marco Harris don't do something. Hey, and don't forget VIP Championship Wrestling next Saturday night. It's going to be a big card right there at the Tupelo Furniture Market in Tupelo. And they got Butterbean's going to be there. Austin Otto's going to be there. And Steve Kern's going to be there. Many, many more. Matter of fact, some of the EPW crew's going to be there. So be there March the 16th right there at Tupelo Con. Right there on Coley Road at the Furniture Market. Wow, that's going to be a big show right there. I'll be there. I'm going to tell you what. A lot of fun. Look at this. Walker, oh, Walker 13. As a matter of fact, uh, if he, he might be a champion, but Ma Marco Harris, he's supposed to be there too. Oh, my goodness. But Walker 13 with that 15, that 
Foote's got to be a 15. But he might not be the champion of EPW by next well, week. Well, that's true. Uh-oh, he's getting mad at the referee. Look yeah, at this. That was a two count only. He, he's not lying. Oh, he's, oh, he's this is going to be it. it. This is it. This is the end. He picks him up. Champ's fighting, though. He's still got some fight in him right here. Uh-oh. Places him on the top rope. Oh, what's some shot gear there? Hey. Look at that. Keep right, boot. right to the face. Here we go. Oh, oh, right off the man. Quick pin right here. One, two, two count on. I thought he had him. You got to give it to Walker 13. I mean, he's battling back every time that the champion gets in control of the match. Thinks he's got it won. Walker 13 wants that belt. He's got a target on his back. I can tell you the champion does. I can tell you that. He went to that German suplex and he just can't muscle him over. Look at him. Oh, but he, oh my God. He power slammed him down. It could be over with right here. Watch him. Two. Oh, that was nearly a three count, two oh count my. only. You see the power he picked him up like nothing, like a little dog. I was going to say, like a, a red dog. dog. I mean, he's throwing him around. Uh oh, he's telling the ref now. It was a three. Uh oh. This. He better be careful. Marco Harris in trouble. Walker 13. Trying to figure out what he's got to do to pin him. One, two, three here. Oh, he's going to try to end it. Whoa. Uh. Oh, and he ducks under. Ducks under again and again. Oh, oh my goodness. Hey, he should. This could be it. Oh, whoa. Two count on. So, 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 so close. What a match. And I'm going to tell you, being the champion is a lot of work and a hard, you know, hard work because you got to go against people like Walker 13 and no telling who's next. But Walker 13 can win it right here. And Marco's in the fight for his life right Whoa. here. Look at this. Oh. He well, looks like he's a little scared of. Walker 13 just set up. Yes. He got up and ain't none of the punches. And he can't take him out. He's doing everything. He's got him in the corner. Oh, and he missed, though. Oh. That, that may have done something. Man. That shut Another him down. One. Got Still has not left his feet. Look at this. Here we go again. Oh! Pulled the knee pad down for that one, and that stunned and, and Walker. And he's still, he's still not off his feet. Comes off the top. Oh, 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 oh that's it. Goodness. That's it. Cold, big cold breaker here, but it's oh. No way. No way. Two count only. I thought for sure that was a three. I Walker. can't believe Walker 13 got out of that. Marco Harris can't either, but he's fired up. Look at him. He's, he's upset. Uh-oh. What is he going to do? Is he going for the cutter again? Oh, and he caught him. He's Mark. stomping on him, man. Look at him. He's over there in that corner. His Mark. feet tied up over there. Oh, he shoved the rail for here. He said ring. We'll see you next week. Thank you, everybody, for watching.